Hey, welcome back guys. We're bringing you an updated video today on how to have multiple tracks in voice meter banana. We have microphone, discord, your console audio, music, and your OBS alerts. Let me say that again. Microphone, discord, console, music, OBS alerts without having to pay for anything extra. No couple hundred dollar mixer. It's all going to be built right into voice meter banana. Follow me this way. We'll get right into it. All right. As you see, we got voice meter banana. up. All right. Mine's already set up. So as you can see here, we got microphone, discord, PS5 audio, voice meter input music, OBS alerts, voice meter auxiliary input. So this video may be a little confusing. It's a little more advanced. I'm not going to go over how to get voice meter banana installed, nor the, uh, the virtual cable output. I'll put a link in the description for my previous video on that one. But as you see here, the PS5 audio. So I have an EVGA XR1 Pro capture card. This also works with any other capture card that's connected to your computer. So your Elgato's, the Hapage, if anybody still uses that one, but I know most people literally use the, the Elgato's. I've been happy with my XR1 Pro now two years, two plus years. It's been fantastic. And then configuring music and OBS, there's going to be another software that's free. It's in the Microsoft store. It's called Ear Trumpet. So let's start by, by getting that one first. So it's in Windows 10, Windows 11, Windows 8. Hopefully you're not on Windows 8 anymore after this time. But go ahead and uh, open the store. Come up to your search. Mine's already in there. But just type ear trumpet. You're going to have the option to, to install. Go ahead and install it. And then once it's installed, go ahead and hit open. All right, after you have Ear Trumpet installed, let me make me disappear for this. Click your task tray, your little icon. You'll see this other speaker icon. That's Ear Trumpet. If you want, you can give it a click right now. You'll see all the audio inputs that you have. So for now, let's set up voice meter. So as you see, your Windows device management, choose your microphone. I have a Yeti. Discord, we set for the cable output. Again, I highly advise you to watch my previous video on how to get those installed. And I also watch through the configuring as well. We made some updates from the last video. And then this one, choose your, your capture card. I have the EVGA, so that's the one I chose. And then you can right click on each one and rename. So Discord. PS5, you can name it Xbox, PS5 console, PS4, it doesn't matter. As long as whatever's going through that capture card is going to be captured. My voice meter input is music. OBS alerts is the auxiliary input. I know it's kind of cut off. You can't see it, but that's auxiliary input. So now here with OBS, as you can see, the microphone's already working. It's bouncing there. But so come to your settings. Come to audio. Change your desktop audio. So this is going to be your music. Change it to the voice meter input because that's what we had. The voice meter. Voice meter input is music. Desktop audio 2. This is where you can capture your OBS or Streamlabs OBS alerts. Voice meter auxiliary input. Just like what we have here. Even though it's cut off, but it's voice meter aux. Microphone. We're choosing the... Not the your your microphone that you have, but we're going to choose a voice meter out. So this says voice meter out B1 because of the track I have chosen is B1 here. Mic auxiliary 2, where you're going to set your cable output, which is Discord. Go ahead and hit apply. And this is where you can rename. So rename desktop audio to music. Desktop audio two alerts. Microphone, we'll just call it mic. 
Mike Ox 2, we're going to rename and call it Discord. Boom. Now you have your music, alerts, microphone, and Discord all in one. We also have a capture card. We're going to add our capture card. We're going to go to video capture device. I'm sure you know this by now. Don't really need to name it, but we're choosing the EVGA. I just like to change this a little bit because we're doing 1080p. Highest FPS, which PS5 does 120. So, you know, we'll just leave it at 120 and we'll hit OK. So we got that in there. So obviously it's down there as your video capture device. We're going to power on the PlayStation 5. PlayStation 5 is powered on. So as you can see, it's bouncing. Obviously you can adjust your, your levels to whatever you need. Mic levels, alerts levels, music levels. Doesn't matter at this point. Because we're all we're gonna set this up to where everything goes through one headset. So we're gonna come back here to voice meter. And this A, these A tracks, that's your monitor. So your hardware out is gonna be your headphones. So I'm using the, the HyperX virtual surround. It's gonna be whatever headphones you have plugged in, wireless headphones, Bluetooth headphones, that doesn't matter. I highly suggest not using Bluetooth because you're going to have about a half second delay. But I do highly recommend using a wired headset or that allows everything to come through your headphones. So let's put them on. So I hear my, my console right here as you see the, the meter bouncing. We're going to pull up a video. We'll, we'll pull up my, this is how to set up voice meter banana. We're gonna give that a play. And then we're gonna come back to OBS. And then now you see the music. Hey guys, we're back with another video. So as you saw, it was bouncing, it was moving, and we're able to hear it. But if you're using the actual applications, this is where ear trumpet can will will come in soon. Because that's also how we're gonna that's how we tune the music output and the alerts. Remember, with Ear Trumpet, you can control, you can choose what application, program, game, PC game to go to which audio, which is cool. So as you see, Chrome, for me, since that's what I use for music, is set to voice meter input, just like to match with voice meters. So how to change that, you would find it in your list, right click on that icon, Hit the two arrows and then choose the input voice meter input and so now we're going to set up the obs alerts so this is where it gets a little tricky so this is where you can find something and create a browser source of something pandora music or if you use channel points or anything like that. So I'm using channel points. So that's going to be a good, good guinea pig to test with. But we're going to get the channel points. We're going to go to browser source. We'll just name it that. Okay, change it to 1920 by 1080. So it matches. Then I'm going to disappear for this. Okay. So we'll resize this however we want. That portion doesn't matter right now. This is just configuring the audio for it. So if you if you have channel points, choose one of your longer videos. So I'm going to use Tommy Boy because I like Tommy Boy. Come so to. I was checking the Specs on the airline. Rotary. 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 I'm ready to turn OBS browser page. So that's the icon that it looks like. And make sure it's set to voice meter aux input. We'll try that again. So we'll redeem channel points one more time. Come to ear trumpet. Find that OBS browser page. Make sure it's on voice meter auxiliary. And then, as you saw, everything was bouncing. We'll redeem it one more time. We'll redeem one more time. And now you can see that bouncing. 
We can hit play he here. Now. Awesome to get things. You see that track. bouncing? So obviously, your microphone. PlayStation is bouncing. So it's all being captured through one program, as you see here, just one, and everything is going through one headset here. And one of the coolest parts that you could do, since you use Discord, PlayStation Five has a seamless integration to Discord your buddy is in a party or anything like that in discord it'll just go straight to the channel i think that's very awesome so no more having to spend a ton of money on a mixer if you like what you saw today like subscribe tell your friends leave a comment below I'll put in the description a uh, link to the Discord as well. If you have any questions, go ahead and post. I have stream help as well as computer help. I don't mind helping out. It's just one of those things that I figured out on and doing some research. I am by no means an expert in audio engineering or voice meter. It's just stuff that I've gained over the past couple of years of what voice meter can do with your computer and how to get it to interact with obs to have separate tracks separate separate controls for for everything i appreciate every single one of you coming by and checking out the video like i said like subscribe tell your friends leave a comment if this works for you if you need help like i said i'll put the, the link in of discord in the, the description